Okay, we're here at 1554 Talmud Street here in Los Angeles, 90027. Now, we're here to check the main sewer line. We obviously cannot check every pipe in the house. But we had a quick little peek underneath the house, and we did see most of it's all pretty much ABS plastic. But you'll have your general inspector crawl underneath. He's physically going to look at everything. We're here to check the main sewer line, and we're running our camera from a two-inch end-of-a-line clean-out located here in the back of the house, if you're facing the house on the left-hand side. Just to let you know that this pipe is not really connected properly uh, because um, it's not glued together. So you, we're going to see if we can push it together, but you need to have somebody to fix it. This pipe it comes from the washing machine over here. Anyway, we've got our camera in the line. We're all the way out to the city connection in the street. There's the city sewer right there, you see. Right there, it's flowing by. So as we bring our camera back, we have a six-inch clay lateral coming back from the middle of the street towards the property. Now remember, there's no major clean-out available to us, and we're running our camera from a two-inch clean-out. This inspection is based on my opinion. So we're going to come back. So far, we're looking pretty good. There's some minor roots. There are some roots. Well, they're not really minor, but there are some good uh, substantial roots in the pipe over here. But there's no way you're really going to be able to clean it. So as we bring the camera back, we'll tell you what you're going to need. Bugs, cockroaches. Yeah. Okay, so that's a pretty big roots over here. There's a big roots over there. You want to locate that? I think we better locate that. Okay, so we've located this actually in the street. Nice. So I think those are pretty big roots over there. It's very possible the pipe could be broken over here. And this is like two, three feet into the street. Look how thick that root is. Yeah. Look, look, at, that. look at that. Yeah. And then, then somebody, yeah, it's complete. <coughs> There's ABS plastic There's ABS. in the sidewalk. Yeah. Here you go. Oh. All right, so that that we you, that's Sorry, no yes. good. That. So somebody replaced the pipe over there, but brought ABS plastic into city property. We're definitely going to recommend that this whole section be replaced at least three feet into the street. You don't have to go all the way, but at least three feet into the street because the rest of it was good. Yes. <coughs> Coming back here, ABS plastic. Now starts to come up. Back to clay pipe here. And then this roots, heavy roots over here. And the cast iron goes to cast iron. Look. Yeah, it's cast iron. It's choked up. Choked up. That's going underneath the the unit, right? That's outside. No, that's still. outside in the front. front. That's out in the front, and then it comes to cast clay. Right. No, that's all not good. There. Yeah, that's not good. And then comes to cast iron pipe, which is going to come underneath the foundation now. So they left this section of cast iron under the foundation. It actually doesn't look too bad, really. And then comes back to ABS plastic. But ABS plastic coming back all the way from there. It's all in good condition. Uh, so I think being that you're going, th going to have to go through all that work, it's better just to replace that section of cast iron underneath the house, that's underneath the foundation, replace the pipe all the way to the property line with ABS plastic, and then go all the way into, under the sidewalk, the park, and about three feet into the street. So that's what we're going to recommend over here. We'll go ahead and stop the recording over here.